One of your choices for the end of the year novel challenge is to create a novel trailer. Before we read most of our novels this year, whether it was for Global Read Aloud or one of our in-class activities, we watched a book trailer to help us get a preview of what was going to happen within each novel and to really get us excited for what was going to happen next. Using an app or a website of your choice, create a one to two minute novel trailer for Bun That Buddy. What do you think is most important? What do you think would draw someone into reading the novel? Your guidelines for this project are listed in Schoology. First, you want to come up with a brief script that's going to outline the key themes, characters, character relationships, and some of the early events that are really going to draw your viewer in. You really want to sell this book with the choices you make as you create your trailer. A couple of ideas would be to include an important quote. Think about Bud's roles. Think about some of the things he says and learns along the way that you think might be important to your video. You may also want to introduce some key characters. Just don't give too much away. Remember, you don't want to tell the whole story in your two minute video. Once you have your ideas outlined, it's a good idea to find images that are going to really fit well with your words. You can find these images in a number of places and there are some hints listed below. Using your words and images, you can use any app or website to help you create your video. For example, when Mrs. Marsh and I created our school rules video back at the beginning of the year, I used Wii Video. There is a Chrome extension for Wii Video and it connects really well with our Google Drive. So this is one that you may want to check out. Again, it's called Wii Video and it's a great way for you to organize. You can drop photos in, you can um, voice record, and you can use all sorts of a fun effects in order to make your book trailer exciting. Though there are many more apps that you could use on your own device, you could use Flipagram, which many of you guys have used in the past to create your vocabulary videos. The choices are endless. It's merely up to you to make the right choice and to do the novel justice. Within whatever you choose to use, you should also add music to your book trailer. You want to really set the mood for what it is, set the tone for what it is that you want your um, viewer to feel. What mood do you want to create through your book trailer? What do you want the experience to be for the person who's watching your book trailer? Make sure you make a wise choice. It also will help if you add your own voice. You'll see in the examples here, for example, the Wimpy Kid trailer that I've attached for you to take a look at it is completely student made, much like yours will be. And the students go through and narrate their ideas. So you could tell your novel trailer from the perspective of the main character, which would be Bud, or you could simply tell it as an outside narrator. It's really up to you, but adding your own voice will make your trailer even more meaningful to the person watching. There are some other things listed here to help you. For example, helpful tips, how to make a book trailer, give some ideas for how to make sure you're not putting in too much, and that you're sticking to the main points. Some of the hints given here are listed on your guidelines, but there are some additional things that may be helpful to you as you're creating your video. The goal of this is to have fun, but also to show someone what a great book Bud Not Buddy was and tell it from your point of view. How did you feel about Bud? Have fun, do a nice job, I'm sure you will, and enjoy.